what's going on everybody welcome back to another video on the channel and in today's video i'm going to be telling you guys my theory on what started the merge in ninjago dragons rising now i do want to be clear that nothing i say is confirmed this is just a theory and me speculating on what caused the merge in the upcoming season Now, all we know about the merge is that it is basically all 16 realms merging into Ninjago and becoming one big realm. Now, my theory starts all the way back to Ninjago Season 5, Possession. In Season 5, we see that Moro's goals are to enter the tomb of the first Spinjitzu Master to get his hand on the Realm Crystal, which is the gateway to all 16 realms. Once he gets his hand on the Realm Crystal, he plans to use it to unleash the preeminent, his master, and the embodiment of the cursed realm. Once the preeminent was unleashed, she would curse Ninjago and every other realm. Possession ends with Nia unlocking her true potential and defeating the preeminent, ultimately destroying the cursed realm. Then, in Ninjago Skybound, we see Nautikon breaks into Hiroshi's labyrinth and gets his hands on the Realm Crystal, which he uses to bring his crew back after being marooned in separate realms. Once the ninja are put behind bars and Nautikon gets his crew back, he then plans to use the crystal to return to his home realm, Jin Jago. When Nautikon and his crew return to Jin Jago, he sees his home destroyed and in ruins. Nautikon then goes to his father, and his father says this, As you know, the 16 realms are interconnected, and the balance affects us all. When one falls, another falls apart. Every action has a consequence. Now, this is where my theory starts. What if the destruction of the Cursed Realm and the destruction of Jinjago caused all the other realms to get destroyed as well? What if Nautikon's father was correct? When one realm falls, another falls as well. Which means that after Jinjago got destroyed, other realms began to fall apart as well. What if other realms got destroyed in a similar way to Jinjago? And eventually, Ninjago is the last realm to fall apart, and all the other realms have already been destroyed, and they've collided with Ninjago. I also believe that Master Wu probably knew that this would happen. He probably knew the same thing that Nautikon's father knew, that when one realm falls, another falls as well. What if the events that have been happening in Ninjago are affecting the other realms, causing them to get fucked up? But anyways, that's pretty much it. I want to thank everyone who watched all the way to the end of the video, and I want to thank everyone for all the growth we've had over the months. And that's the theory. See ya.